Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you all are having a great day. My name is Erin and I am a mom of five and a reseller on Poshmark and eBay. And today I have a thrift haul to show you all. Um, it's from two separate days. I went to four stores total. So um, on Friday I went to three thrift stores. I went to two Goodwills and a local one and I found like 19 or 20 items. So. Um, I was hoping to find more, but it doesn't always work like that. So then I went again yesterday, which was Sunday, and I went to just one store, and I think I got nine or ten things. So I w was hoping I could find more because I'm trying to increase my listings to ten a day. Um, so I have 30 items about. So I'll just have to find um, some items around the house that I haven't listed yet. Um, to get me through the week because um, I don't think I'll be able to go again thrifting until Friday. So we'll make it work, but um, let me show you what I got. So the first thing I have is Maeve, which is anthropology. And so since it doesn't say by anthropology, it is a little bit older, but it's a maxi dress and the material is so comfy. It feels like tinsel. Let me see what it is. Um, and Maeve, um, not all anthropology sells that well right now, but Maeve does always seem to do pretty well. So even though it is probably an older style, I still thought it would do well. Oh, modal? Model? <laughs> M-O-D-A-L? I don't know. I should know that. And polyester and spandex. So it is really comfy. And I think right now with everyone um, being home more, um, comfortable clothing is so popular. So this is um, pretty and dressy, but yet really comfortable. So I think it'll do well. Then this was exciting. I hadn't found this in a little while. It's Diane von Furstenberg and it is one of her wrap dresses. Um, and the color is different, it's like cobalt blue and has, I think those are probably three quarter sleeves. Um, so something that's happened, I actually have found two wrap dresses somewhat recently and both of them, the bottom hem, I didn't realize until I got it home, but the bottom hem had come undone. So I don't know if that's a common thing with her dresses or if it was just a fluke thing that happened, but this hem looks really good. So. I'm gonna always start checking her wrap dresses to make sure the hem is intact because um, I don't know if I can even fix it. I'm not a seamstress and I don't really wanna try, so I might just redonate them back. But just something to look for if you find her wrap dresses. Um, so that should do well. Then what I have been finding a lot of lately, Athleta. So it is a little bit older because of that label. It's a size six, but it's a skort. And these do seem to sell pretty quickly, even though they are older. Um, so I found it in gray. And then I also found a black one right next to it. So I think those will sell pretty quickly. This brown I hadn't found in a while, but it is a good one. Frame, and these are La High Skinny Crop. So, and these feel like they have never been worn. Um, and the high rise is always a nice find. So I like that brand for jeans. Um, I was thinking that jeans, I've been finding a lot of good jeans lately and I think it's because people, I mean, obviously people probably aren't looking through the jeans section in the thrift stores that much right now. Um, so I think now's a good time to really look through them with, um, Probably in the next month, people will start buying jeans again. So even though right now, most of my jeans are sitting, I, I want my closet to be stocked full of them when people are ready to buy them. And I think your chances of finding good jeans um, are good right now because probably not a lot of people are shopping for them. So make sure to always check those out. Another Athleta Extra Large Skort. It has the little side pockets. And that's an older style too, I believe. But it was in good condition. Oh, only from, it's from spring of 17, so it's not too old. 
Then this I found, it is a Kimmy and Ken by Anthropology, and it's a tank top, but I really like the material. It's like the scuba fabric, so um, it probably won't sell for a lot, but it was just really pretty, so I decided to get it. And this was another Athleta, and it is a swim skirt. And I'm thinking about maybe keeping this because if I can find a top that would match it. Um, it's just a tie dye. Just thought it was pretty. Then I got Free People. What size is that? Size large. And this is like a semi sheer. Just a little oversized blouse. So I don't know, I debated this one because a lot of the free people isn't selling um, as quickly anymore for, or as um, for as much. And I actually didn't look up how this one was doing. So I hope it will sell well, but it was pretty and it's nice lightweight material. And this one, I don't know if I've ever sold, maybe I've sold one of this brand, Bella Doll. Um, and so it's sometimes anthropology. Um, these look very like they're anthropology. They're the cropped wide leg um, raw hem. So um, I can't remember if I looked these up. I'm trying to get better and really look stuff up because things are constantly changing um, what's selling. So hopefully these will do well. But since that, I haven't sold a lot of that brand and I hear a lot of people buying it, I just thought I would try it. I've got a lot of anthropology this time. So another anthropology holding horses. And this is, I believe the straight, yeah, straight leg. And the comps on these looked pretty good. So we'll see. I don't think I've ever sold holding horses jeans before. So we'll see how quickly they sell. This one was exciting. I think I've only found or sold this brand one other time. Tadashi Shoji, I believe. Could be wrong. <laughs> but it was just such a pretty dress. Just black and it has just like little mesh details. And it's a nice length and then it has like a flounce hem. Just thought it was so pretty. Um, and I looked hers up because I was thinking it would sell for more. A lot of her dresses... The comps um, for the solds weren't the, as high as I thought they would be. So I was a little surprised about that. And um, so we'll see, hopefully, I mean, it's such a pretty dress and it's, um, you know, I think a lot of people would like this style. So hopefully it will sell well. Then I found another one of the Bella doll. And this is just like a hooded sleeveless um, tunic or it could be a little dress. And it has like these raw seams on the side. And this is just a really comfortable fabric too. Um, this one's tinsel. So I just thought it would be a nice little summer. It could be a cover up or just a lightweight dress. This brand I'm always excited to find, Ted Baker, um, the sleeves, just thought this was so pretty. So I think this will do well. Ted Baker always does well in that style. Just seems like um, it would be a popular one in the fall. This brand, I've only found this one other time, but it is gold sheep. Um, looks like Christmas. <laughs> so these might not sell right away, but um, I think by Christmas season, someone will get them. Then I found another Athleta, uh, Small Tall, I believe is what the ST is. Um, but these are just really nice, like a thicker fabric. It has the zippers and the little side pockets and they feel pretty much brand new, maybe worn once. Um, so I had to get these. 
And these are from, let's see, holiday 17. So about two and a half years old. I've been buying a lot of this and we'll see, I might regret buying so many um, when it does become jean season if they don't sell, but um, they're J. Crew. but this is a newer style is why I got them. Um, well, fall of 18. But I think they're slightly cropped, maybe ankle, and they have the release draw hem. So I thought the style was pretty and they look like high rise. So I still think they'll sell, but they might just not be for a whole lot. Then I found some Lululemon pants, and I haven't looked these up yet, but I think they're the Wonder Unders. We will see. Um, the nice thing is this one, the, the tear tag is gone, but it has a little pocket on the inside with the size dot, and then that size dot, I don't know if it'll focus, has around the edges of it the style number. So I'll be able to look it up to see what exactly these are. This was probably my find that when I got home, I realized I probably shouldn't have gotten, but I still think I'll make my money back. Um, they're just some Nike dry fit um, pants. I didn't look these up when I was in the store. I just thought like they were just such a, a comfy, soft fabric, um, really lightweight, but they're golf pants. So um, the comps didn't look that great on them. Um, a lot of people were selling them brand new for, I think, maybe $25. So these aren't brand new. They feel brand new, but they don't have the tags. Um, so I probably won't make a whole lot from these, but I just thought they were nice. So I got them. This brand I'm always excited to find is Beta Brand. And these are extra large, uh, short, petite. And they're, uh, these are yoga work pants, so really comfortable. These were in great condition. And I have another pair in my closet that I found a few weeks ago, um, and they still haven't sold. All the other pairs of Beta Brand have sold, um, usually within a few days, but this pair still um, has not sold. I don't think I've even gotten any offers on it, um, but it, they're striped pants, so I'm thinking that might just take a little bit longer. So hopefully, the solid gray should um, be a quicker seller. Quicker seller. <laughs> okay. Then we got We the Free, Free People, and this is a large. And these always seem to do well, these oversized tunics. Um, so it looks comfy. I would like to wear this. The picture, model picture had it like it's really wide neck and it was slightly off the shoulder on the model. It looked really pretty. So I think that will sell come fall. This brand um, is Vince. And I find um, pants quite often from Vince and I don't get them. They usually seem to be kind of older, outdated styles. But these um, were really cute. They're like a jogger dress pant and they have little side zippers. So I, I thought I would try these and see how they do, and I might even keep them if they don't sell because they'd be a great just pant to wear to church or somewhere out to eat. Okay, these were cute, I liked these. Um, J brand, which I pass on a lot, but the style was so unique. Um, they're like a coated black jean and then the hem is so pretty. It's this lace, floral lace hem, and they're like a cropped length. So um, I think these will do pretty well. I already have these listed. I can't remember what I listed them for. Maybe 40 or 45. So hopefully they'll sell quickly. This was exciting. So Goodwill um, just put out their sweaters and coats. So I was going through the uh, sweater section and I found this Patagonia which is always so hard to find lately people once they're out people snag them up pretty quick but um, there's actually two of them one was like a cream color um, but it had some stains so I didn't think I could get them out so I got this one um, and it's in great condition so these always do really well 
fun find. Then I got another Maeve, and this one has the Bi Anthropology, so it's a newer one. And it is just another maxi dress, really comfy fabric. Um, so I had to get that one. This pair, um, so I go through the pants um, pretty much at every store, the women's pants, and because I always find the men's Lululemon in the women's section, they um, are always in there. I don't know if I've ever found men's Lululemon pants in the men's section. Um, so these are in the women's section and um, I couldn't find it had the, I saw this, I'm like, oh, that looks like their tag. And then the feel of these pants, you can just tell are Lululemon and then the snap button. That's what I always look for um, to find them. So I was so excited to find these and I found them and I couldn't, I was looking on the legs, I couldn't find the logo. Um, and not until I got home did I see that the logo is on the back now. So I don't know. I don't know if these are newer, um, but they're in really good condition. And these are ABC pants, I believe is what they're called. Just gray. So I love when I find these. They seem to sell within days. So hopefully these will too. These are already listed, so we'll see. They sell here soon. And uh, this brand, Cloth and Stone. So I just found another, uh, like a chambray dress a couple weeks ago and that sold really quickly. So I was excited to find this dress and hoping it sells quickly as well. But it's just a really pretty lightweight summery dress. This one, maybe I should not have gotten, we'll see. <laughs> Show me your Moo Moo, which um, is a good brand, but it seems like it's slowing down a little bit. Um, so this might take a little bit to sell, but I just thought it was a pretty color and it's a shorter dress. So we'll see how it does. And then my last item was another Lululemon. This one has the tag still attached and these are like a burgundy sweatpant. And the size 12 is nice. Um, I don't usually find sizes above maybe like an eight or six and four and six seem to be the most common sizes so a size 12 is exciting to find um so i think these will do pretty well i need to wash them they got a little stain that should come right out but that's the logo so and once again these are in the pants section also not in the active wear so that is everything that I found. So if you enjoyed watching this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more videos like this, and I will see you all next time. Have a great day.